stopped you with my quirk. I'm sorry I didn't ask first. But I figured you wouldn't mind me catching you. I don't know what you're talking about, but good for you. Now that you mention it, I think I have heard of it. It's a tool used to defeat your enemies by making them eat it, even though it's not poisonous. One, two, three, four, and five. And that makes six. You're one away from seven. I love this school very, very much. I used to have friends I could talk to and teachers I was close to. But now it's just... Did something happen? I still don't know how to hold a sword or throw a punch. I can't figure that out alone. Will you please teach me? From time to time, there's a corpse like you born in the world. You're dead, but your will remains. Your body functions, and you kill humans. You're called Shikabane. Well then, if someone asked you to sell me to a foreign country, would you do it, Kyoko? I'm really curious. Hmm, yeah, maybe. I miscalculated to think that I let all three of them get away. But as long as I stop you from getting any further, my plan will still succeed. Those three are just children. They should be taken care of quickly enough. Howdy, and welcome. I'm a senior official of Thousand Eyes. Call me Shiryasha. This is our headquarters located in four-digit gate number 3345. What? How dare you! I won't forget this, Three-Eyed Baldy! I'm gonna train harder this time! And then I'll come back and I'll crush you and be bigger and stronger than ever! Are you asking us if we would like to join your group? But why? Why are you collecting all the shards? To excel at the sword drawing technique of Iaijutsu requires perfect timing. Whether a scabbard's there or not makes no difference. That's what you get for overusing your quirk in a short time frame. Consider your crooked right hand as a warning from now on. And just so you know, I will not heal injuries like this anymore. <laughs> the search is on! These books are all about fire engines. This book has pictures of fire engines. This book is a Detective Nuzo's recounting of an arson. <laughs> Natsumi! I'm on to you. Whatever crap you're planning, just leave it alone. Save the smile for someone who buys it. You're up to something. I can see it in your eyes. We've had enough of this! You're both to blame for this fight! <laughs> Hika-chan and Kao-chan, I want you to make up and go halfsies on this cake! Oh, Jeebus, what am I going to do? If you can't excuse crime because the devil made you do it, how can I hurt someone because God told me to? How dare you! You would call me a traitor? I swore I was a member of this group eight years ago. I'm jealous of you. I bet you travel to all sorts of fine places, don't you? I wish that I could travel some time. This mansion's so dull. That guy was huge, but you took him on anyway. For a girl, you're way too reckless. Here you go, Belle. You sleep on the bed instead of the sofa tonight. I mean, well, since you're injured and everything. How noble of you, Iki. There's no need for us to turn this into an international incident. In light of your apology, I will show you my mercy. Say you were walking along, and suddenly you found a letter attached to a balloon. How do you think you would feel if that happened to you, Yuki? Hey! Huh? From the Fall Selection Office! Fire Dragon! I am back! I've been looking for you! Yo! Hey, how's your day going, Natsu? <laughs> sure enough, that's impossible for a normal human to beat! It's the latest model, upgraded to wipe out the Needless! She can't compete! Why shouldn't I cry? Akimura and I have been friends for a really long time! Well, at least I thought we were. Come on, couldn't you at least make an effort to be polite? I came all the way here to meet you. Huh? I think you're wrong. <laughs> I know I'm not very smart, but I think whoever wrote this was very brave to say what he felt in his heart. It's a beautiful, sensitive, wonderful letter. Do it. Transmute us both. Then the gate will open. To take us back. Oh, 
wow. I guess when tests roll around, even Osaka has an interest in studying. All right, ask me anything.